simultaneous processing of multiple specimens of any cellularity, to make cell blocks with nano units. Notes recommended to watch following videos, before watching this video processing of single specimen of any cellularity, to make a cell block with nano unit how to break the larger cap seal, to open the larger top cap by hand, how to break the larger cap seal, to open the larger top cap, by cutting open, if it cannot be broken by hand, how to remove tissue paper cover, with dry glove fingers from envelope pack, the videos proceed at rapid pace for quick viewing, please pause and play as needed. Organize and label all the respective components which include Concentrated specimens Nano next-gen cell blocking units Transfer pipettes Tissue cassettes Lay out and label all the components as shown Tissue paper covers removed out in advance from its envelope pack using dry gloved hands. Check the labeling of all the components as shown by matching each label carefully. Open the larger top caps of all nano units. Pour out the green transport fluid from all the nano units into the discard container. Add more than 0.5 ml of concentrated resuspended specimen with respectively labeled pipettes into the corresponding nano units. Close all the large caps, and centrifuge the nano units at 2500 RPMs for 3 minutes. Open the large caps and pour out the supernovant into the discard container. Add 10% formalin to all the nano units with concentrated specimen sediments in the wells of the gelat narrow bottom portion of the units. Close the large top caps, and centrifuge similar to the previous centrifugation step, at 2500 RPMs for 3 minutes. Pour out the supernovant into the discard container. Moisten the tissue sponges, with 10% formalin, in the transport container, and lay out along the bottoms of all the tissue cassettes. Open the small bottom caps, by twisting anti-clockwise. Sometimes, the washer in the small lower cap, may remain with the narrow portion of the unit. Remove the washer and dislodge the gel disc, over to the moistened tissue sponge in tissue cassette by pushing with tip of respectively labeled pipette. Change the glove if contaminated with specimen. Open all the small caps by twisting anti-clockwise. The washers usually come out with the small caps. Dislodge the gel disc into the respectively labeled tissue cassettes. Place the previously removed tissue paper covers over each gel disc with concentrated specimen sediment filled wells. Place other formalin, moistened tissue sponge, over the tissue paper covers, in all the tissue cassettes. Snap close all the tissue cassettes and stack them. Put all the cassettes in the transport container, with 10% formalin. Keep all the cassettes in horizontal position, with bottom down, with the help of packing material, such as balled up paper towels. If contamination is a concern, submit each cassette individually, in separate transport container. Fix for more than two hours, or for the time set by your laboratory protocol. Proceed with histology tissue processing for paraffin embedding. Discard all used material.
Summary of Procedure Step 1. Organize, Label, and Check Step 2. Discard the green transport fluid Step 3. Add concentrated specimens to the respective nano units Step 4. Centrifuge at 2500 RPMs for 3 minutes Step 5. Discard the supernatant Step 6. Add 10% formalin Although 10% formalin is used in the demonstration, any other reagent or fixative may be replaced as required by the user protocol. Step 7. Centrifuge at 2500 RPMs for 3 minutes. Step 8. Discard the supernatant. Step 9. Dislodge gel discs from all nano units into the respective tissue cassettes, with moistened tissue sponge at the bottom. Step 10. Cover all the gel discs with tissue paper covers. Step 11. Add other moistened tissue sponge on all tissue paper covers. Step 12. Close all the tissue cassettes, stack them, and transport in horizontal position, in 10% formalin, for tissue processing. If cross-contamination is expected, please put the tissue cassettes in individual transport containers, with 10% formalin and send for tissue processing after fixing for at least two hours, or for duration recommended by the individual lab protocol. Summary of procedure on one page. 